Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Karina and today I'm back with a hairstyle video. I feel like it's been so long since I sat down and talked to you guys about my hair. So today, so excited, I'm going to be sharing a way to get like a thick long ponytail like Ariana's signature ponytail like this and all kinds of different versions with it without actually growing your hair down to your butt. Let me know if you guys want to see more hairstyles related to using a long pony like this. I'm more than happy to make one for you guys. So this is what my hair looks like without the extensions with nothing on right now. As you can see, it's not very long and it's not very thick either. But first off, what you want to do is put your own hair into a high ponytail. When I'm doing that, I like to first have like some hair in front of my face like this kind of like framing my face because I don't like it when my hair is like all the way slicked back I don't know I just feel like it's more soft and romantic to have some kind of hair near the front of your face so I do that always just make sure you take a brush and brush all the stray hairs to a high ponytail Ponytail itself can be as high or as low as you want. Um, I typically like it high like this because it looks more glam But you can have it either like this or even like at the nape of your neck if you want. I found a place This is where I'm gonna tie it Okay, so this is what it looks like after I tied a high pony on my head It's not very glam looking as you can tell <laughs> Looks kind of like hey <laughs> Here's the fun part. So this part is when you take your hair extension ponytail. Oh my god, I'm so excited to show you guys. So these type of hair extension ponies, you can find them everywhere. I believe you can find them on Amazon, you can find them on like a lot of different specialty stores, and you can find them with both synthetic hair and also real hair. So this one I'm using right here is from Luxury for Princess. If you're not already familiar with them, they're a hair extension company based in Europe and I have used so many of their hair extensions in the past. I've tried a lot of different brands, but this one is the one that stuck with me the most because I find in terms of like hair quality. I have a whole video showing you guys how I put on their regular hair extensions, so check the link below if you're interested in that. This time I picked up their ponytail. These ones are made of real hair. This is the 26 inch 170 grams real hair pony extension so they look like this this is in the shade hazel blonde which matches my shade like perfectly like look at this i would say this is more like a balayage shade consisting of like different shades of blonde as well as different shades of light brunette so if your hair is highlighted like mine or if your hair is bleached in any way this would work out amazing for you so each pony hair extension comes like this now you have this like your main hair part which is this part and it has this four clips right here so this is where you would stick underneath your actual ponytail it comes in a velcro and this is the part where you wrap around to like hide all the velcroness i'm gonna be putting it on now so first what you want to do is you want to stick the four pins right underneath the elastic band of your own ponytail and then once that's secure you want to make sure that it's really secure because this ponytail is heavy so now that it's secure there's a velcro part with a tiny strand of hair you just want to make sure that the velcro is all the way enclosed around your ponytail and just make sure that your elastic is not showing through anything after you've wrapped around the entire velcro around your own ponytail, take this little piece of hair and wrap it all the way around the velcro of the ponytail. This way you hide both the velcro of the ponytail and also creates the illusion that you have your own hair wrapped around your ponytail. And then when you're done wrapping the strand around the base of your ponytail, what you want to do is take a bobby pin right here and just pin it into place. Now, you might need more than one or two bobby pins just to keep everything secure and not falling down because I find that in my case, my ponytail is so, so heavy because it's made of real hair and because it's so dense and thick that I ended up using around three to five bobby pins. Ta-da! There you have it. In the beginning when you're doing this by yourself, it might take you a few tries before you start to get the hang of things because it can be really difficult to like place the Velcro right because it's so heavy and to strap the little strap around the base of your pony. But don't worry. I think it took me maybe like two or three tries before I was able to do this fully by myself. If you have a friend helping you, that's even better. And then once it's on, you just want to make sure you brush it with a regular hairbrush to make sure that no stray ends are showing if you want that sleek ponytail look. You like my hair? Gee, thanks! I just bought it. <laughs> 
And if you get these pony hair extensions, because they're made of real human hair, you're able to do whatever styling you would to them, like your normal hair. So I'm going to be curling them. Okay, so I've just finished curling it and this is what they look like. There's literally like so many options you can have with a long ponytail like this. You can have it up here, you can have it down here, and you can braid it. You can do all sorts of styles with it. Okay guys, that's it for this super easy tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And let me know if you guys want to see more hairstyle videos like this. Leave me a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Um, 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 um... Ha <laughs>